So one of the things I'm gonna do to my car today is uh, install this Steeda clutch spring. The stock one, which I still have to take out, is uh, it's um, this like two-stage spring, and um, it's got like the big one, which is about this round, but like uh, half of this length, and then a smaller one, and it because of that. Well, maybe I should take it out and show you first instead of just talking about it right now. So let me uh, do that and then I can show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so the uh, spring that I'm gonna take out is this one here. So let's do that. I gotta get a uh, vice grips. So uh, the way to do this is to, what I'm gonna do is depress the clutch. And then, hope I can do this. Yeah, this is gonna be tough. Maybe a little smaller, actually. I think I need needle nose pliers. Okay, got needle nose. Let's see if we can do it with these. <sighs> Fuck, I can barely get under here. Woo! Oh, whatever, we'll try. Let's try doing this. This is not fun after you just had a late hockey game the night before because I am sore. And I'm trying to contort into this weird position to get to this thing. Oh man, I got grease on my fingers now. I wonder what I can do this with. Ow! Fuck! <sighs> That's gonna leave a blister. Ah. 
doing good. There we go. That's one way to do it. it. Took some prying and prodding and a freaking blood blister, but I got the uh, the old one out of the car. So you can see that it's a it's dirty, but it's a a two stage spring. It's got the small one and the big one. And that, those combine to, um, when you have the clutch depressed all the way, it doesn't force your foot back. It's not linear. So like you have it all the way down. It's not really forcing your foot back, but as you put it on my other screen, as you start to let go, it starts to push more and more. It like, it like kicks at you. So that makes the, uh, engagement of the clutch a little weird. So I'm replacing it with the Steeda one, which is one linear spring. So it has the same force all the way through. I don't mind that it's pushing back on my foot when I have it depressed, cause you're not gonna be holding it for that long. That's how it's been in cars for a while. So I'm gonna try it out and just uh, see how it works, but I'm expecting it to be pretty nice. And uh, yeah, let me just clean off this old stuff. I'm going to save this just in case I go back to it. There was another piece. I thought I was missing something, but uh, this goes somewhere in here too. Just like that. that. Yeah. So that's actually how it goes. There's the two springs. Okay. Let's grease up this one and get it in. This is some grease I got at uh, Winchester Auto. Molly graph multi-purpose grease so the parts that were greased up were these parts and the uh the shaft in the middle. Yeah.
Okay, I think it's good to go. Okay, so now I can do this thing. Like, smash it down a little bit. Ugh, come on, work with me. I got it. That's it. Well, that was tough. Oh, that blister. <laughs> Not good. <laughs> 